today we're going to talk about adding a little bit of international flair into your design work. I had the opportunity to take a class with Alex Choi in uh, Washington DC this last um, month um, at the AIFD National Conference so we wanted to share some of those inspirations with you and so today what we're doing is creating a structure so he he created a uh, different type of bowl out of a structure and so I created this bowl out of the aluminum wire from Smithers Oasis so the decorative wire um, we have the etched gold and so down in here what I've just done is I simply keep moving down the wire and wrap that around my finger that way it stays a little bit consistent and what I'm doing is forming holes that I can poke my stems into so then I just brought that into that base and then here we're gonna come and just add the bowl on top there and then start adding some of our design elements into here. So, and what we're gonna do is kinda keep spiraling around as we're going. So, <laughs> we got a little water spillage. I guess it's a little full. So I'm doing a couple at a time here, just laying them together and coming in. Just adding a little bit of that wheat so it gives a little bit of that upcoming season, kind of that harvest season, pre-harvest. And so as we're, got stuff all growing here. So coming there and then just another, a little bit different type of grass but just adds those different textural influences. And this one we're just gonna bring a little bit higher. And so now that I've kind of got all my wheat in going the same directions, I'm able to kind of see that pattern and keep following that through as, um, as I place the rest of the stems. So what we're gonna do is do a negative space in the middle. So um, what we want to keep that exposed. So I'm just coming with the floral material right around the edge. So here's um, a Scoops, which is a new variety. And then some of the new Lembush grown Lysianthus here, which is a great look. We're just coming in with some of that right on the rim. And then we have some of the new Lembush Brown um, cut calancho. So I used some of those in an arrangement last weekend and it was a conversation piece. Everybody was drawn into it and taking a look and saying, what is that? So um, it's kind of treated like a tropical, so it stays out of your cooler, um, but it'll last four weeks potentially. Um, we added it as a test crop last year and actually I had some last about five weeks. So, but three to four weeks um, in regular grow or uh, conditions. So let's just take a look into that so you can see that great look. And so I really get with not a lot of um, different materials, I get a great presentation and a little bit unique. So what we wanna do is do things um, that create conversation pieces. So this is something, um, if you have one of your customers that is having a special dinner, the best form of advertising that you can do is to create some conversation pieces. So lastly, we're, or not lastly, <laughs> is adding in the textural um, differences again, kind of the shiny hypericum. So as you can see, we're just doing it in a spiral pattern. It's, you can see the stems down that are exposed are following that same spiral pattern um, throughout. So that just creates that interest um, coming down in the water, reflecting um, in with the metallic influence in there. So it's coming in with a couple of little Kermit mini gerbs. There, and, and 
some drumstick alium it's coming up kind of adding just a little bit more of that depth and so coming above there you can see Lastly, we're just gonna do a little bit of veiling coming in with some of the plumosa. And I am going to tailor it a little bit. Oh, I got it carried away. Just thinning that out a little bit. So just taking off a few of those pieces just to give me a little bit more transparency through there but it just adds a little bit of a veiling layer, but still keeping that transparency, kind of adding that vine look. And so just adding just a little bit more of that influence of that spiral motion. So this is our international presentation of kind of the influence coming from Alex Choi and my interpretation using all the great flowers. So hope you uh, take this into your shops and give it a try and get inspired to try something new.